Okay. Well, good morning, good morning, good morning, everybody. Um, well, I got my laundry going downstairs, so I'm going to try to keep this as short as I can because it's going to be, uh, my laundry is going to be ready to go here in about 15, 20 minutes. But I was browsing the uh, Twitch Reddit here and came out came upon another good, another good topic here. Um, be kind of a good, uh, reevaluation for me as well. Um, just, it's always good to do something like this uh, from time to time. Um, keep myself up to date and all that, so. It's called the Stream Guide for Beginners. Some of the, I did kind of peruse part of this, but I uh, figured uh, this would be the kind of topic that would be good to make a video out of. So I'll go ahead and add that. Uh, by a guy named Faze Pyre. Decided to update my previous guide. I'm beginning on Twitch. Hope this is helpful. Okay, but like, like usual, I'm just going to go on and do my own commentary on it. Uh, I'm going to be checking out other people's posts as well. Uh, just doing some commentary on them as well. So, I'm um, not, not trying to call anybody out. Not trying to embarrass or humiliate anybody or anything like that. It's just a lot of times I can get inspiration from reading other people's posts. Well, I guess we, we're starting with the basics here. Coming up with a name. Um, like any product. Uh, that's kind of an ugly P word. Um, I stream because I, I enjoy doing it. And it's also probably one of the few times in my life that uh, I'm actually social. In real life, I don't really talk to anybody. I don't really talk to anybody in my family or anybody, anybody at work all that much. So this place here is... Streaming is a great outlet for me, so I don't I don't consider myself product. So that kind of a bad word with me. But anyway, like any product, you want something that's ken catchy, simple, and mem memorable. Well, my name is Joe Schmo. Not a whole lot of other people out there they're gonna have a name like that. Usually, uh, usually a lot of the other names out there are, are real badassy sounding, you know, just real, uh, real tough guy sounding, for lack of a better word. So, so check. So I got that. For those who really want, you can have a theme. Um. I guess it something like that. I think starts going out of the realm of product. So having a solid branding, and again, again, I do this. I do this for the love of it, not not in the hopes of not in the hopes of making myself into a brand name. I mean, I mean, would I like to make a full time living out of? Hell yeah. I'd love to love streaming to be able to pay all my bills, but it seems like doing that. It seems like doing that you're required to become a product, something I'm not a really big fan of. Some people just make a channel and their username is something unoriginal and unattractive. That pro that probably mine, Joe Schmo. Um, and again, I think uh. Me and this guy have two totally different visions of this. Um, again, again, I'm not, I'm not looking, I'm not looking to make the big bucks doing this. I mean, like I said, I wouldn't mind making a living off of doing this. What am I streaming, paying all my bills? But I mean, as far as, as far as trying to, trying to, how do I put it? Trying to market myself. Uh, no. Sounds more like selling out than anything. Mine's easy. Uh, catchphrases? Don't really have any. So, and again, again, I'm not, again, I'm not product, I'm a streamer. That was what that was what I was looking for. Well, 
Until I can actually get subs, I ain't gonna pay attention to this. This I do. Or at least that, um, in one of the games I stream, Final Fantasy XIV, um, I'll often end dungeon runs, like, see you all on the flip side. This I do. I typically stream around 4 p.m. U.S. Central Time. Very, 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 very seldom do I veer from that. Yep, yep. Yeah, this is a new one. On the flip side, don't stream too much or you'll burn yourself out. But like I said, I, like I said, I stream because this is an outlet for me. So it's something I'm gonna be doing daily. I don't, I ain't gonna do it no once a week or anything like that. Okay, um, I'm gonna go under the assumption that that anybody that's uh, watching this already knows the basics of streaming. They know what a CPU is. They know what a GPU is. RAM. Uh, hard and soft drives. Monitor, webcam. I will say this. One of my requirements for uh, for me watching a streamer is they got to have a webcam. I got to be able to play place a face to the voice. Otherwise, it just doesn't feel right. You know, you're just a disembodied voice talking in the background. I hate that. Microphone, same thing. I gotta hear you. I don't want to. I don't want to be coming on no silent stream. Um, network. Yeah, I kind of agree with this. And last I heard, five megabytes per second is actually a minimum, not a standard. capture card never seen one of these before this is something I'm starting to consider here too um, actually streaming console games but unfortunately the only console I have is a PlayStation 4 and I also have something called a Yobo it's a bootleg Nintendo Which, hey, I didn't even think of this. That's to reduce the load in your PC if the processor or graphics card is being used just for the encoding as the game is being played on the console. I hadn't thought of that. Yeah, that would take a lot of pressure on my PC. My PC is basically a, it's an entry-level gaming comp, so nothing super powerful about it. So this is mostly basic stuff that I would assume uh, everybody would already know. Set your encoding bitrate. Um, I think I have mine set to 2500. Um, my resolution I think is I want to say, say 1360 by something. Um, FPS, I got that set to 60. Priority access to transcoding for you. Um... Yeah, and this is just basic OBS stuff. Um, a lot of this is gonna... Again, your logo is your face. Again, I don't use logos. Like I said, I, I'm a streamer, not a... not product.
when you can buy them online if someone made um overlays i think the overlay only overlay i got is twitch chat and the only reason why i have that in there is uh in case of uh, me and one of the guys having a conversation any new viewers that come on at least they can see the chat they can see the chat and see what we're see what we're talking about so they're not so they're not for so they're not stuck in the middle of a conversation they have no clue about but otherwise um yes if you are going to use overlays keep it simple this is another one of my turnoffs looks like freaking cnn or something you got ticker tape on the bottom and you got like all these ads all over all these windows and overlays and whatnot all over the damn place i can't hardly see you where's the streamer at you know so information panels um i make heavy use of this but again i don't use anything fancy on mine it's just about me uh what games i stream my schedule um stuff like that uh social media um this i use too you're gonna need to use more than one outlet i use I stream on twitch obviously um but i also post on i post on twitter i post on the uh, final fantasy 14 lodestone blog I post on there as well so and from time to time I'll just like I'm doing right now I'll post stuff on YouTube um this I agree with but um this I agree with but uh there's also a flip side to this so more on that a little bit later uh, but yeah, that it's that's another turnoff for me when I'm watching other streamers, streamers that shut up, or, or streamers that never talk, just total dead silence. This is especially true when if I see this and they got they got this in front of their face, but they're not even using it. They're not even using it. Yeah, that's kind of a turnoff, man. You got the peripheral, buddy. Use it. But uh, but aside from that, the uh, other flips that I was talking about, I this is another thing I can't stand. People who don't shut up. I mean, just everything nonstop, by diarrhea at the mouth. Blah, 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 just, I mean, I mean, I mean, talking to yourself. I try to do that too, but I mean, just anything and everything. Like it's just nonstop motor mouthing. That. That makes me flee a stream pretty quick, too. So, there's a balance here. Aha! One way to help with this is to add very light background music. Uh, background music, to me, is actually integral to my stream because I'm one of few... Uh, I'm one of few people... I'm probably the only streamer I can think of, maybe one person, but I haven't seen him in years, that... That, uh, I play vinyl records when I stream. Got me a little turntable, like right here, right here, where I play my records. So, um, this one here is going to be a bit of a weakness of mine, especially these days, because my eating habits have changed. I now fast. Typically, I fast uh, twice a week. I'll go for up. I fast for up to 22 hours on those days. So because of that, I basically have one meal a day, which in probably the streaming community, unfortunately, uh, is I eat when streaming. So there, so oftentimes I have to get up and go to the bathroom, and then I gotta go fix me something else to eat. Uh, typically, I eat in three rounds, so I don't have all my food here all at once. Because, I mean, to me, yeah, that would be kind of tacky. So you're just... You know, just sitting there and stuffing my... You know, constantly stuffing my face and hardly playing the game from all this food sitting out here. So, yeah, I'll... I'll do it in three trips. So, like I said, this is kind of a weakness of mine. 
I'm off it. I'm off an AFK, but again, it's due to a lifestyle change. Don't play oversaturated games. Well, no problems there. I tend to play the games most people don't. Like uh, Final Fantasy XIV. It's popular. It's a popular game, but really, that's only popular in probably Japan or something. I mean, but from my experience, not very popular. So, um, I also play Grim Dawn, which not a whole lot of people play. Uh, Bloons Tower Defense Six. Not many people play that. Once a week, I'll play pinball, but very few people play that. So, so no problems there. Yes, totally agree with this. Don't call out the lurkers. I've made this mistake before. And there's times when I like to check out other streamers and just lurk and watch. And I have had people... Oh, hey, welcome, Joe Schmo. Welcome to the stream. I'm off the door, pal. So, yeah, don't call them out. This right here, don't beg. If I uh, another turn off for when I watch other streamers, if I see, if I see a sub goal, um, if I see a viewer goal, if I see any of those, I'm probably not going to be on that stream very long. Uh, be confident. This is something that's going to develop over time. Um, I was, I think when I first started streaming, I was pretty much a nervous wreck. I still, I still remember my first video. Well, hi everyone. Um, well, I'm totally new to streaming. Um, so, um, I'm gonna stream uh, Final Fantasy 14. Um, yeah, I'm playing on my warrior. Um, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna run some dungeons and probably run some hunts. Um, yeah. Um, so, but after streaming for three years now. Very rarely will you see me. Oh, by the, by the way, by the way, this is just a little quirk I have. Um, it's something I've it, it's something I've done ever since I was a little kid. This. Um, but you know, don't flip out too much. Uh, Jesse Ventura, ever heard of him? Yeah, you ever see him in interviews? He does this all the time, you know. So. Who's comfortable, comfortable, confident, and knows what they're doing. If you don't fake it till you make it. Yep. Um, network. This is another weakness of mine. But again, again, I do check out other streamers. Not nearly as often as I used to. But, again, most of those, more often than not, just like everybody else that comes to my stream, I don't stay on them very long. So, support other streamers but again again I gotta like I have to like the streamer but again 90% of the time I don't there's just something about them that kind of turns me off so and, and organically support their endeavors what that also means is genuinely your your love for that streamer has to be genuine don't force it find streamers you actually like and enjoy who are around um, yes, I, he makes a good point here, too. I mean, you should check out top streamers from time to time, just to know what the climate is like, but, I mean, I don't, I heard, I mean, very rarely do I watch those top streamers. I mean, you don't matter to them. I mean, I'm plain and simple. I mean, I mean, because they already have hundreds of thousands of other people talking to them. They're already well known. Um. Okay, there's an analogy I'm looking for for this. Oh, it, it's like it's like if you're at a, if it's like if you're at a club. And if you're, if you're say at a wet t-shirt contest, you know, all the girls have their wet t-shirts, and you got the girl with the, the big fake double D's, and boom, 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 boom. You know, every guy in the club, yeah. I mean, I'm not even gonna bother checking her out. I'm gonna look for this um. Uh, 
looking at this slightly chunky girl that nobody's paying attention to that's, you know, kind of lo sitting there lonely over here, you know. I mean, that'd be the one I'd be gunning for. You know, okay, I mean, I ain't gonna bother, you know, I ain't gonna bother talking to this, what, you know, this fake double D girl up here that everybody and their dog's watching. I mean, that, I don't like to compete. I mean, where, but, you know, you got this girl, you know, you got this girl over here. I bet she'd be a lot more receptive to you. I mean, no one's paying attention to her. You know, this is kind of the same, this is kind of what he's talking about here. You know, I wouldn't even bother with the top streamers. I mean, hell, you type something down, type something down in chat, and moments later, whoop, up it goes. Never to be seen and heard from again. You know, so it just, too many layers of bureaucracy just to get to the mayor, or uh, the streamer, excuse me. Fishing, it's kind of like fishing, too, without something else I was thinking about. You know, you know, you got, you got a, you got a walleye fishing hole over here. They're not that hard to catch. They're great eating. But it also means that's, um, that's a prize fish that every other fisherman's got to be over there <laughs> crowding around there fishing for. Whereas, you got this spot over here, you got, like, yucky catfish, you know, hard to catch, you know, not that great. You gotta, like, pour ketchup A1 sauce or, you know, barbecue sauce or whatnot just to make them tolerable, that kind of thing. But on the upside, ain't nobody else fishing for them. They're, they're all yours, buddy. Go get them. So, again, same thing here. So, yeah, he makes a very good point about this. Ensure your support because you care about their stream, not just yours. Yes. Yep. He says the same thing here, too. So, so really, he, he should have said network, and then I would have added in parentheses when possible, or when possible and practical. Create channel competitions. Uh, I guess. This kind of goes over my head, but I'm not at that. I'm not near at that point. Okay, uh, bots don't really do. It just creates another layer of bureaucracy that just makes a mess out of everything. Excuse me. I think um, I looked at Nightbot one time, but. Again, I I don't really need it. Okay, uh probably a weakness of mine here, but I think I use the same email for damn near everything. But um based on experience I don't really get doxing, swatting, etc. So I don't use. Uh, I only use PayPal when absolutely necessary. I don't trust them. Oh, and uh, I don't. I don't use Discord. I don't do any other. I don't do any other kind of vocal communication software thingy outside of Twitch, or outside of me streaming on Twitch. Uh, too many bad experiences with it. Um, I've had a, I've tried talking to other, other streamers that use Discord, but more often than not, I'm just completely ignored. I'll try chatting with them, but they're too busy talking to their buddies on Discord to really pay attention to me, so goodbye. So I'm not, I don't want to put somebody else through what I've gone through. So, Discord is pretty much a no-no for me. Okay, so it looks it looks like I'm not even halfway done with this uh this page. Yeah, this is kind of going over long. Um, as my uh, laundry is about it's probably about done right now. I'll just go ahead and uh, end it here. So, but like I said, you kind of get you kind of get a general idea of how I see things. So, 
Uh, but like I said, I gotta break off. Gotta go grab my laundry and then gotta get my uh, gotta get my uh, have, gotta get my uh, gotta get my stream set up. So still got a fair amount I have to get taken care of. But aside from that, hey, thanks for watching, guys. See you all next time.